Hello there everybody, my name is Katafi, and welcome back to Super Smash Bros. Ultimate World of Light. Last time we got Inkling, looking all, all rather nice. We also got Wii Fit Trainer who we were playing as last time. And this time, we are going to go get some more people. Probably. First off, we have two places that have things finished up on. So we're going to head back and probably get those taken care of. First off, there's Mushrooms, which I'm going to go down here, play as Muddy Mole first so we can just show off Inkling. Furry immunity, that sounds good. Also, Polter Pup, fun game, fun game. Take your strongest team when you're this no frills battle against Muddy Mole from Mole Mania. All right, Inkling. The way to play Inkling is pretty simple. You just have to ink everything, which I'm doing a terrible job at. Okay, listen, you're, you're, you're a mole, just stop. But yeah, you want to just cover in ink as much as possible because the more ink you do, the more damage you'll do later. Um, it's B, right? Yes, okay. I've not played as Inkling too much, but the way Inkling also works... Okay, do you want to stop? Because as far as, like, spraying, you just hope for the best. I'm not... Yeah, I'm not the best with Inkling. As you can tell! But I know that at least covering and this move is actually pretty good. Get over here. Nope. Also, the blaster is always good. Yeah, blaster is super powerful. Super powerful indeed. The main thing is you want to try to ink up the enemy as much as possible, and then after you ink them up, you want to try your best to do as much damage as possible. Rapid A works very well, and the side uh, side special, but I can't play inkling too well. But, I mean, hopefully. We have time to learn. We have time to learn. What do we have here? Top man. Cool. Leaf from Animal Crossing. Why not? The enemy is easily distracted by items. Sounds good. Tetra. I didn't realize I got a second Tetra. I didn't. I don't remember when I got you. Huh. Because Tetra, for those who don't know, uh, if she enhances Go! into uh, a character, as you saw. And... I mean, enhancing is, is pretty nice. But hers is, like, super obvious. Because I've already played as her. Okay, do you... What the? Get off of me! What? What the? You... What? The monkey's beating me up! No! 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 Stop! This is rude! This is rude! I'm being beat up by a monkey! Seriously? Alright. Let's just do this. We'll do that. Alright. This this is weird how... Why this is... Oh. This is fine. What? Get out of there. That was the slowest kick in the world, but... That works, that works. I don't know how I like went from facing that monkey to just getting absolutely destroyed by the monkey. But I mean, as long as we're alive, as long as we're alive. That's good, right? That's good. Uh, I know a few people, a few people who show up to my streams are very good with Inkling. I very much am not one of them. I'm mainly a Yoshi and a, uh, Yoshi and a Lucina player. Most are Yoshi. Defeat the main fighter to win, the enemy heals over time. Sakura. Sakura. I get you, Sakura. Sakura is a uh, shrine maiden from Fire Emblem Fates Birthrights. So she has her good old sister, Corin, who I believe is actually... Yeah, she's dressed up as Hanoka, her sister. Okay, that was rude. You are... Okay, this is bad. Meet the... Yeah, you want to defeat the main fighter to win, and you just fall off the world. You just fall off the world, and then sad things happen. That's great. Defeating strong targets will net you rewards. You don't say. You don't say. Okay, first things first. I think I want to throw a bomb. If I throw the bomb, everything would work out well. Nice. Okay. That actually did not work out as well as I was hoping. Ooh, two hits. Oh, that was a strong hit. You what the? What just happened? 
How'd you use that in such a smart way that I never even thought to use? That was incredible. That was amazing. Good job, Isabel. I've heard Isabel is one of actually the strongest fighters in this game. I still argue K. Rool is, but that's just me. All right, we haven't been here in a while. Who do I have that can do this? Oh, Veridi. That makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. Olimar? Makes even more sense. Oh yeah, Boom Boom and Pom Pom. They're still here. All right. Do -do -do -do. Olimar, his good old Pikmin. A game series I'd rather love. What the? What? Stop. Okay, listen. Discover your ink. Stop. The rude. Nice hits. Oh, he's still alive. No, you got a purple. You got a purple Pikmin. Get out of here with that purple Pikmin. Look at that. That was beautiful. That was beautiful. You, purple Pikmin. Got him. That actually worked rather well. Her ace, her fast A actually works very, very well. And that bomb, that bomb throw was perfect. He, he jumped the wrong way, but it actually worked out very well. 800 songs. It's actually even more than 800. I want to say there's over 900. I feel like I got a ton. All right. Well, that's pretty good so far. Anything else we can get right now? We're slowly clearing out this map. Slowly but surely. Let's head up to where Cap'n is, shall we? We have a few things to do over there. Okay, that's not where Cap'n is, but there is something over there that I do want to get to eventually. Why not? Let's do this. Neutral specials, that works. That's Matthew. I don't know what he gave her from, but that's fine. That's fine. We'll figure that out later. We'll probably face him later. I don't think we've faced Matthew yet, have we? No, we have not. We have not. Also, four Ellie's? None of you are... None of you are elephants. Hold on. Also, I feel like team battles are not your strength. Listen. Your whole thing is just... Really? Also, these turtles are all pink. These turtles are all pink. Also, another cool thing about Inkling is that her up, uh, up special it actually does damage. We just do show this off. See? It actually does damage, which is pretty cool, but not too useful unless somebody is just charging and then you just kind of go behind them. It's pretty cool. Pretty pretty cool indeed. Oh, keep it up with my charts there. So that's not too bad at all. You're doing rather well for if as inkling. Uh something else I want to check though is I wanna see we can't do anything about that. I do want to come back and make sure I do all of the challenges. Beetle Shop, it hasn't been enough times past. Slashman. We can actually get these two knocked out, I want to say. Also, there's, here's one thing I don't really like about World of Light. I have said a lot of good about like what I feel about here. What's bad is this map. Like, if you're trying to do this, this hurts your eyes a ton. I don't know if it's just me, but like every time I move around the map to kind of see like where something is, it just hurts my eyes. Maybe it's just all the, the lights or anything, or all the colors. The floor is sticky, stamina battle, the enemy favors back in their attacks. All right, well, this music is dope. That's not a word I use often. It's not a common word in my vernacular. Okay, well, you two of you are dead. All of you are dead. That was by far the easiest ever. Slash man. Slash them all up. Slash slash slash. I've only played one Mega Man game. Now that I'm thinking about it, have I said this before? I probably haven't, actually, now that I think about it. That Mega Man X Command Mission is the only Mega Man game I've played, which is a not a me really a common Mega Man game people talk about. I did have the idea of, uh, of playing it and streaming it once. Because I've beaten the game 100%, but, uh, I don't know, probably, we will. It's a game that not many people know, not many people seem to really care about, but 
Hi. You are covered in... Oh, you know what? I realized that all my attacks work rather well. That hurts. I, I witnessed my, my entire issue there. Okay, you want to just stop there. Okay. Get over here. Thank you. Why is that movement speed, though, so devastating? Like, I'm just walking like a... Like a... Rock on sticky soil? I don't really know. I didn't... I couldn't think of an analogy in time. I'm sorry. I can't come up with things... I can come up with things on the fly, but sometimes not analogies. Alright, that's entire area done. Let's go figure out what Cap'n's thing is. By the way, I did end up getting uh, Cyrus... Uh, Cyrus is another person. Um, I got their... The thing again so we can actually build bridges again i can't remember the other person's name why can't i i just edited it it's sire cyrus and somebody i can't remember i my brain can only handle so many names it needs defense up what the? all right ganondorf listen you are annoying to face wow Okay, we need to heal. Hold on, can I grab a dragon? I grabbed a dragon. We're good. Nice. Oh, there goes Char Charizard blew up? Hold on, I don't feel like that's how a dragon dies. That hurts. That's a lot of damage. Nope. Come on. Wow, you just rolled right into that. Good job, Ganondorf. Good job indeed. That's eight. Ashnard. That's an amazing looking dragon, dude. Oh my goodness. Dragons are so cool. Can we talk about dragons for a bit? I want to talk about dragons for a bit. When I was younger, okay? Uh, for, oh, first off, let me first off do skill trees. We'll talk about dragons in a moment. We have 87 things of the skills. 87. Shooting items, throwing items. Makes grabs and stuns easier to escape. Strong throw. I think that was pretty good. I just missed this level 81. Special move power up. Poison damage reduced. Batting items. Meteor smashes. Meteor smashes are pretty much all I do. People, I believe, probably yell at me because of that. And improved escape. Why not? So far, we have a lot of skills. Also, I want to switch people because we have Inkling done. So we have Olimar now. Olimar... What up? Well, it's technically Olimar and Alf. However, I like Olimar's outfits better. Wait, is one of you guys... You're pink. You're close enough. We'll play as Alf. We'll play as Alf. Why not? Alf is uh, pretty cool. Alright, Captain, what are we doing here? Beep, beep. Now we can go as Captain through here. Where are you taking us, though? I'm curious. You will take us all the way through this ends up on the other side and there's a person nice Let's see who we have here isabel nice all right oh we're fighting isabel with olimar i don't even know how to play olimar that much okay anyway dragons so dragons uh when i was in like middle school, elementary school middle school i used to have like tons and tons of books about dragons i've actually had there was a uh, a book i remember this book fondly it is called uh, My Father's Dragon. Love that book. Still love this book to this day. It's a it's a weird book where it's a guy who's like, he's recounting his adventure where he went to an island. I, once again, I don't know how many people have read this book, but... Well, first off, Isabel joins the team. Nice, that was actually very easy. I'll talk about Alf's stuff in a bit, because now it's Pikmin Mook, but... Father's Dragon, he, it's like three parts. It takes place first on the island, then on a sandbar with a bunch of different things, and then back in the city. And it's so enjoyable to read. I always had, excuse me, so much fun reading it. When I was like, in, I first read in second grade, and then I just can remember continually reading it. But all in all, I, I don't know why, but that book just spawned my love of dragons. And, just so much good stuff. Timmy and Tommy. Alright, well, I guess we'll get them in a moment. 
So, dragons. I'm in Dragon Rider. There's the Dragonology books that I've had. So much good stuff. So much good stuff. Annie. Enemy is easily distracted. Irreversible controls. Is that what said you, dude? Hold on. Do you do that? Why? Wait. Why irreversible? No, just don't. No irreversible controls. Oh, because there's going to be the dumb poison mushroom thing. That makes sense. Okay. Isabel. Ah, oh, she's... She died pretty quickly. Also, we're giant because PD Piranha. Oh, yeah. Well, we were giant. Meanwhile, while playing as Elf, you just... You can throw Pikmin, get him back. Alright, goodbye. This mushroom is the one that reverses your controls. That's why it's so weird. Wanna get over here? Wanna get over here? Alright, she's dead. That was the most grace graceful death I think I've ever seen. Good job. Good job indeed. Um, but yeah, you essentially use Elf's Pikmin. You want to make sure you have all three Pikmin at any time. If you get three purples, you are the luckiest person ever. But I don't think you can actually get three purples in this game. I think you always get three different colors. Purples are just amazing. 500 spear points, not too shabby. Not too shabby. I think... Okay, it's going to hurt my eyes for a little bit. Where are we? Ooh, the villager's right there. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. That is actually super useful. Uh, do I want to fight Teddy right now? Not really. I want to go this way. We'll do Baxter and Forthington from Rhythm Heaven. Which, for some reason, at one point, I said it was Rhythm Haven. Listen... I don't know what I was saying about that. Baxter and Worthington. I still gotta play the Red Heaven, Heaven games. Played one for a little bit. Hello, Incineroar. Alright, let's just throw some people. Okay, never mind. Wait, just shells. I'll throw a blue shell. Why not? Just throw. Wow, that was an amazing catch. Okay, that sucks, though. There goes all my Pikmin. Okay, so the cool thing, though, about the Pikmin is if you played a Pikmin game, you'll know that fire pic uh, red Pikmin are immune to fire, yellow Pikmin are immune to electricity, and the blue Pikmin are immune to, like, water-based and ice-based attacks. The cool thing is they still, they still are affected in your actual game itself. So the red Pikmin, like, as you saw in that bomb, they didn't die to the bomb. Uh, I did, though, and my, my suit cracked, so that's fine. <laughs> but yeah, to the bomb bombs, uh, red Pikmin will live. Purple Pikmin are super heavy, so they will usually survive a lot longer than the others. And then white Pikmin are immune to poison, uh, which there's only really one instance of poison. Okay. Alright. This, you are gonna die. Alright, well, I guess this is happening. Also, once again, you'll see... Just the red Pikmin are still alive. You know how I said that. I meant it was the blue Pikmin. Because I'm really weird. Alright. You have left yourself open to some dangerous attacks. Alright. Purple Pikmin are going to definitely do some crazy things. That sucks. Oh, that's bad. How do you feel about this? Alright. Good stuff. Nice purple Pikmin for the win. Going good. Oh no, I dropped my card. Alright, cool. Baxter and Forthington. I played Pikmin 1 and 2, though. Pikmin 3 is. I've heard good. I've seen the plays. Digby, and we're fighting Isabel. That seems a little, a little screwed up there, don't you think? We're still fighting Isabel even after we fought Isabel? That's fine. That's fine, I guess. Also, Digby and Isabel are both, I think, brother and sister, right? I, th I think that it's implied that the that Isabel wants to be with the mayor. So. That's why I'm like, I can't remember if it's brother or husband. I don't think there's... Is there any... Wait, in Animal Crossing, are, is anybody ever married? You can't marry anybody in that game. You just... Wow, you... Ooh. 
I mean, it's implied that, like, there's there's Valentine's Day and everything, but no one actually gets married. That's so weird. I just realized that. I mean, it is a Nintendo game, to be fair. At the same time, though, you feel like that's part of, like, a life and village simulator. Then again, there's The Sims, but The Sims you could do terrible things in. Me? Huh? Okay. I guess we're fighting a... Uh, me sword fighter. I did not think we would be fighting a me sword fighter. Are we fighting Zord? No. Well, I have an idea for this. Well, now that this is a thing, uh, I will. I have an idea on what I want to use as the Mies for for the series. Then I had an idea in the past for like multiplayer, but I guess now we're doing that here. That's pretty good. Pretty good, all things considered. All right, I think we'll do maybe one or two more. That sounds good. Nice. Skill trees are so good. Ah, oh, we can get Yuri. Yuri Kozukata. Who is great auto heal? Oh yeah, I got Celebi. I've never used the great auto heal, so I don't know what to expect. But I guess I'll be healed amazingly. Yuri is actually not bad to go against, because I've gone against her once, as can be seen, I believe. She just uses her Fatal Frame thing, her camera, and she'll take pictures. But, like, as long as you hold your shield, you're actually okay. Yep, unless that happens. He also does not do too much else other than that. Yeah, other than that, she's actually a really easy fight, as you can see. It's it's just weird, though, because hers is, like, very easy to combat against, which I always found strange, even the first time when I did that fight. But hopefully that helps somebody. Hopefully I helped somebody out with that. Cool. All right, let's do actually two more. Let's do Timmy and Tommy. Easily distracted by items, you don't say. Pukumuku. Yukumuku, I think is how you say that still. I don't remember. Timmy and Tommy. This guy looks possessed. Ready? About to fight. Wow. Whoa, hold on, guys. Listen, I... Okay, listen. I have a lot wrong with what is going on right now. Listen, I... Stop. Okay, stop it. Listen, stop it with your little rockets. I... The rockets are the worst thing, which are gyroids and not rockets, but they're close to... Wanna come down here? Good. Nope. Good. Goodbye. Nice. Mr. Saturn, how are you doing today? You want to... Goodbye. Be nice. Oh, I'm on fire. How do you feel? And death. Nicely done. Okay, Timmy and Tommy, are you in another shop? Hopefully you are. Let's buy some things. Buy a lot of things. That was weird, though, with their, their ears and tails. Ears and tails. Hey, they can do what they want. Ooh, you do sell things. We got a second shop. Nice. Super mushroom? Sure, we'll buy both. I'm going to buy both just for safety's sake. Just because I don't know what else to... <laughs> There's not too much to spend spillet points on except for leveling up, so... Minotaur. Stamina battle, battle. The enemy shields off and the enemy doesn't like to jump. Alright, well, good thing we have more stamina. Be the last one here. Pac-Man. Take you down. You don't like to jump. That sucks for you now, doesn't it? Well, guess what? Who's... You're going to want to stay as far down as humanly possible, then, I'm guessing. He's like, I'm above the ground! This is weird! Oh. Grabs are going to be super simple against you. Yeah, these grabs are super simple against you. There's one fight I'm super looking forward to. I saw a video of it, and it was the most hilarious fight ever. Alright, come on. What? That was my yellow! Get back here! 
Bye, Pac-Man. Alright, that's it with Elf, aka Olimar. That's good. That's good. Alright, I think that's where we're gonna wrap this one up, though. Left, right, dash. At least two Pikmin with Olimar. Yeah, if you have one Pikmin, I don't believe it works, but... Cool! What do we have going on here? Ooh, the bridge! Well, good thing we have Cyrus. And... This Cyrus. Yeah. Alright. Ooh, we've got some more characters on the way we can get. Cool, we're slowly getting more and more characters. It's pretty good. Pretty good, all things considered. It looks like eight's also our magic number for how many times will we choose a character. So that's good to know now. That's really good. Anyway, with that, I think next time... Uh, why not? Next time we'll do this entire area and probably lead back into the city. How about that? I think that sounds good. Anyway, here's our map. We are slowly getting way more, so this is going quite well, quite well indeed. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Have a wonderful day, night, morning, afternoon, and or evening. My name's Katathi. I'll see you guys next time for more Variety Gaming. See you guys later. Peace.